Hi, I'm Melissa Skinner with SNS Whitetails, and this week's recipe is Snappy Sloppy Joes. I chose this recipe because actually a friend of mine recommended that why not choose something for them to take to the New Year's Eve party this weekend. So let's get started on this week's recipe. You will use one to two pounds of ground venison. Along with that, I also uh, chopped up one medium red onion as well as eight ounces of fresh mushrooms, and I brown that with the venison. You will also use one cup of ketchup, along with a half a cup of water. Also one cup of, I chose um, some tomatoes along with some green peppers, and you mix that all together, along with one tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce, one teaspoon of red sauce, red pepper sauce, that is. Add a little spice to it. Go ahead and put that all in there. Along with one tablespoon of horseradish sauce, and that's fresh horseradish. Along with a half a teaspoon of garlic powder. So put that all in there together. Boy, this smells really good. And you mix it up really well that all together. Now I also um, put in there some salt and pepper too as I was frying it up. So it will look like this. And I will put that in my crock pot or you can put it back in the frying pan too depending on if you're wanting to take it somewhere. But you will let it simmer for approximately 20 to 25 minutes. So again, it's one to two pounds of ground venison along with eight ounces of fresh mushrooms and you will let that simmer and cook with one medium red onion. You will also add, something I forgot to add, 12 ounces of chili sauce. So you will put that and mix that in there really well. Again, one cup of ketchup, a half a cup of water, one to two tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce along with one teaspoon of red pepper sauce along with a half a teaspoon of garlic powder and if I forgot to mention one tablespoon of fresh horseradish sauce and you will mix that all together like I said and let it simmer for 20 to 25 minutes um, or you can put it in your crock pot and let it cook in there for uh, an hour or two on low and it will be ready to serve on some buns. And again, for this recipe, you can make sure to check out our website at thebestredmeat.com. We're also on Facebook, we're on Twitter, Instagram, as well as Yahoo, uh, sorry, YouTube. Uh, our video will be posted there too. So any questions, please feel free to message us or give us a call. Uh, again, it's SNS Whitetails and our website is thebestredmeat.com. Thank you and Happy New Year.